I'm John Show, a bishop in the United Methodist Church serving Greater New Jersey and Eastern Pennsylvania. Today, I come to you with a heavy heart. Ida, the storm, caught us all by surprise, and we're still learning about the damage that was done by Ida. We're seeing that uh, seven of our churches were badly flooded. One of our parsonages was flooded. We also see in communities devastation, people having to get out of their homes, many people rescued. More than 25 people died here in New Jersey because of Ida. This has been a devastating storm. No, it's not as, as, as great as Superstorm Sandy, but the lives and the churches that have been impacted have been every bit as significant as Superstorm Sandy was. And so we're gonna to need to work together. We're gonna to need to work together to help churches rebuild. We're gonna to need to work together to help communities and, and neighbors rebuild. There are people who are out of their homes. It'll take uh, years for some of them to get back in their homes. And it will happen because Greater New Jersey comes together and helps in our communities. We did this during Superstorm Sandy. We had a significant impact all across Greater New Jersey, and we're gonna have that same kind of impact. It may not be as large, but the lives that were impacted are every bit as impactful as Superstorm Sandy. So today, I'm asking you to give generously. We've started a fund to help people here in New Jersey to recover from Ida. You can go to our webpage, www.gnjumc.org and make your contribution. Or take an offering in your church and send it to us. Some of it is gonna to go to Louisiana because they've got challenging ch problems there. And some of it will continue here in Greater New Jersey to help our neighbors. You know, this is our opportunity to do all the good we can so that God will shine in our communities. This is our opportunity to come together as United Methodists and show that we are stronger together. And this is our time to remember, as Jeremiah 29, 11 says, God did not bring us to this place for our destruction, but a future with hope. With you and your generosity and working together, there is a future with hope for people and communities that have been uh, destroyed, for churches that need to rebuild, for other communities and families that need our help at this time. So let's all work together for a future with hope.